that allowed? Are you allowed to say ass on lifestyle profiles? Nobody reads that. Welcome to Lifestyle Profiles. I'm Wendy McGowan Ellis, and today our guest is Melanie Nance. Melanie, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you, Wendy. I appreciate you having me. Yes. So I wanted to have Melanie on the show today because she wears many hats in the Frisco community and almost everyone in town knows you and knows who you are, but I don't think they know your entire history. So tell us how you came to Frisco. So I was grew up and raised in Dallas area and then lived in Tulsa, Oklahoma for about 12 years and then just moved back to Frisco area three years ago. So I've been here since then. My family was all still in Texas. So Texas is home. Good. And I couldn't get back sooner. That's great. That's wonderful. And now you're a realtor with the Cheney Group. Yes. So yes. let's talk about that a little bit. So part of my moving back was I got my real estate license and moved back to do real estate and quickly ended up on the Cheney Group and they are awesome people if, I mean obviously you guys know them, but if you don't know them personally, they're they're great to work with. Um, but yeah, so do real estate, residential real estate, kind of all over North, North Dallas area. So full disclosure, Scott and I just closed on our own home. And I wasn't going to say that. Well, I, full disclosure, I will. Um, and Melanie was our realtor, and we, you were amazing. Well, thank Everything you. went smooth according to plan. There was a 50 million forms, but you sent none of them. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe how many times I've signed my signature. But it was it was a great process. It was Good. super easy. Well, you guys are were fun to work with. Thank so. you. Thank you so much. Down. So you also have another side project. Tell us about that. So you are probably talking about Get to Know Frisco. And that started because I had several clients over the summer moving from out of state, all different states, not just California. Everybody thinks everybody's coming from California, but they're moving from everywhere. Um, I had several at the same time, and so I just kind of wanted to create something that would help them make friends, make personal relationships so that they would um, be able to find referrals for doctors or date nights, fun things for their kids, things to do. So we do get to know Frisco, and it's every second Thursday of the month. And I do different venues so that people can check out different areas of Frisco. And and the next one is tomorrow night. Yes. Yes. So it is at the Reservoir at Maine and Preston right okay. there in front of Hutchins Barbecue. Okay. okay. And so the Reservoir and um, their Facebook page where people yes. can find details. You, okay. Yes. Where, where, what's that? So you can go to the Get to Know Frisco Facebook page and okay. the event is posted on there. But it's 530 to 730 at the reservoir free so it's free to attend um, and there's a little bit of everyone it's obviously intended for the people who are new to the area right to meet people but there's a lot of the locals that the will mayor come tends to. to show up Jeff yes. Cheney typically does show up um, some city so council people do too also it just yeah, yeah. depends um, anybody's welcome to come the people who are new to the area get entered into drawings so I have Ooh. sponsors each time yes that will do anything from $25 gift card all the way. I've had a $200 gift card or a gift basket with a multitude of things. And so the sponsors do kind of neat prizes and um, those, the people who are new to the area get entered into those drawings. So actually with that, this time, instead of just the people who are new to the area, we talked about doing anybody who's started a new business in the area. Oh, very nice. So new, okay. new businesses are welcome to come tomorrow as well. Um, and we would love to have them. Are obviously. you going to let them stand up, say their name, their business? So they don't. They get entered into the drawing, so if they okay. win. But I do different name name tag colors. So okay, So the locals good. will know, oh, the red people are new to the area or new businesses, so I should go introduce myself and welcome them. Um, so the new businesses, obviously there's a lot coming to Frisco, so why not help them get connected? And so that's why we added that part in. Wonderful. So anything that we should know or be on the lookout for for real estate industry in 2019? I know a lot of us are here and we've owned our homes for a while or several years, but are there any trends or tips that you're seeing in the industry right now? So I think a lot, a lot of people have noticed the market has already shifted a little, but it's 
and they're stressing about that, but it's a good thing. We're actually, I think, leveling off to where it was two years ago when it was more of a normal market. So yeah. more of the local buyers will be able to come out next year. So I think that'll be a great thing for real estate. Are you so, still involved with the chamber? Like in, so I do a lot, okay. I do a yes, lot of let's talk about uh, that. philanthropy type thing. I just enjoy, obviously, I wouldn't do get to know Frisco. I just enjoy connecting people and helping and giving back to my community. So I do chamber and multiple Frisco Women's League, and multiple volunteer opportunities. But the chamber's been awesome, really helped me get connected. I wouldn't have even met the Cheneys, I don't think, right away without that. Um, but yes, I'm still very involved with them as well. It's Wonderful. a great place to get connected. One of the best people, pe people, persons, if I can say that, or is it people, <laughs> people, people? people? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. One of the best people, people in Frisco, <laughs> Melanie Nance. Melanie, thank oh, you thank so much you. for coming today. I appreciate it. Yes. Thank you for having me.